Hey everybody, welcome back to A Late Show. You know folks, even from a distance, I can sense your excitement. Because it's time for the next installment of America's favorite game show, The Colbert Questionnaire. We're not bringing the graphics up this time? And the award for best performance by an actress in The Colbert Questionnaire goes to... I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Meryl Streep! Hey, everybody. We're here with Meryl Streep. Meryl, thanks so much for agreeing to be part of tonight's questionnaire. Um, the, now we'll get into the, the heat of the meat. This is the actual 15 questions on the Colbert questionnaire that help reveal exactly who a person is. All right? It, 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 it's going to be painless, I promise you. And at any okay. point you say, I don't want to do this, just walk away. Just walk away from the camera, Meryl. Oh, God. Meryl Streep, what is the best sandwich? Pastrami. On? Rye. That's the correct answer. What's one thing you own that you should really throw out? <laughs> Every piece of clothing in there. <laughs> Especially this shirt, which I've worn on seven interviews. What's wrong with the shirt? Nothing, but people are sick of it. But I have nothing else. And I was thinking of wearing a plaid shirt, and now you're wearing a plaid shirt, so... No, it's, it's a good, good thing I didn't. It's simple, it's silky, it's good for the holidays because it's cranberry. <laughs> exactly. It fits New England well. Okay, what's the scariest animal? Ooh. I, uh, black widow spider, which I, you can identify from the little white spiky um, egg pod. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Black widow spider, okay. And the little, uh, the, the hourglass on its belly well, too. It's, yes, no, but the, the way you can tell the nest mm -hmm. is if that, that looks like a coronavirus, but white. All right. That's their mm -hmm. All right. egg sac. Apples or oranges? Apples. Of course. And the reason being, you can't put peanut butter on an orange. <laughs> People have though, okay. in my family. Have you ever asked someone for their autograph? Yes. Do you mind, not, mind telling me who? Richard Nixon. Did you get it? And I got it, and it was on a Milky Way wrapper. And I was 12, and my dad took me to San Francisco, and he was in a parade, and I ran alongside the thing, and I reached up the wrapper, and he wrote his name on it. Do you Do still I have, have it? it? No. I wrote Richard Nixon when I was 972, so when I was eight years old, I had this idea that there should be continental flags. We had state flags, we had city flags, we had national flags, why not continental flags for unity of nations? So I wrote, uh, uh, what's, uh, what's uh, Trudeau's dad? Um, Pierre Trudeau, I wrote Pierre Trudeau, I wrote Richard Nixon, and I wrote whoever at the time was the president of Mexico, got a lovely letter, letter back from uh, Nixon's office saying the president is, uh, loves your idea, and he sent a signed book of photos of Nixon with children. <laughs> Do I have it? I mean that no. <laughs> okay, ha uh, let's see. What do you think happens when we die? I think we see everyone we love, and we then go back and influence the lives of everyone we've left behind. I like that. Favorite action movie? There, you've stumped me. The correct answer is The River Wild. <laughs> okay, do you have a favorite smell? Apple pie. Do you have a least favorite smell? He's sitting right there. I can turn it right there. <laughs> he produces that smell, but he isn't doing it now, so. Exercise, is it worth it? Yes, it is. Okay, flat I or sparkling? Do it. Flat sparkling. or sparkling, sparkling, okay. Sparkling. Most, most used app on your phone? Oh, um, the podcast. Sure, the podcast. Little... One mm -hmm. more time with the gesture, please. <laughs> it's CBS. We have to blur that, I think. <laughs> what podcast are you listening to? And send me some links. Okay. You get one song to listen to for the rest of your life. What is it? 
Oh, Hajira, Johnny Mitchell. Wow, okay. What number am I thinking of? <laughs> Three. Okay. Describe the rest of your life in five words. Very, 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 very long. Meryl Streep, everybody. Now you know her. Thanks again, Meryl. When we come back, George Clooney reminds you which fruit is a great source of bongs. <laughs>